with all your movie success and writing success, and I've talked to you in the past about how you started out, what I like about you is you're such a regular guy. And, and by that I mean your plan is to go to the comic book store today. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then, wait, wait, what were the two places you go? You're going to the comic book store. And then you're going to Tokyo Toy. Toy Tokyo, yeah, that Toy place Tokyo. is great. What's that? <laughs> and, and I tell, but what is the comic book store you like? Uh, Midtown Comics is a pretty good comic book store. What kind of comics do you read? I read all kind of comics. I read like superhero comics, uh, Marvel comics, and I read uh, kind of. I follow writers more than like the series. There's like who are your faves? Uh, Garth Ennis is one of my favorite mm-hmm. writers. See, part of uh, part of the problem with me is yeah. Like, I haven't kept... I used to, when I was a kid, I had every comic. Yeah. And now I haven't kept up. And then and then when I get these compilation books, yeah. I read the comics. I yeah. love comic books. Yeah. But then to go buy individual copies of comics... It's you, tough. Because you can't, you don't know where the beginning of the story no, is it's and true. all that. You're in the middle of it. Yeah. So no, how do you true. keep up? Do you have a subscription to these comics? No, you... I'll try to, like, pick them up as they start. Or uh, or sometimes you can go back and catch up on the ones that you... But, yeah, I mean, they, they're always starting, like, little mini-series. So that's kind of what I what I try right. to grab. So, so, so you try to grab the entire series. Yeah, definitely. I don't like to jump into a story in the middle. But so, most so, of these writers now, through, like, smaller labels release like their own like they call them like creator own series and and there'll be like six comic runs of kind of just little original things so when you go to the comic book store you say to the guy listen yeah i don't want any nonsense <laughs> i want to have a, a complete story don't fuck with me man yeah, right right listen i'm a celebrity yeah. <laughs> I, I'm coming to i know story. my shit <laughs> are there a lot of people in there uh, sometimes, yeah, Do yeah. they get excited? Hey, there's Seth Rogen looking at comics. Sometimes. Comic book fans are generally kind of shy and nerdy in general, so they, they're not up in your shit too much. You get but probably treatment? they go home and say, hey, Mom, I'm not a loser. Seth Rogen. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. He was really high. And he was really <laughs> exactly. Yeah. See, I'm on the right track. I'm doing the same thing he's doing. <laughs> it's just, one time I was in a bookstore, actually, and uh, a, a like 14-year-old kid came up to me. And he's like, and he was holding two books. He's like, you're my fucking idol, man. Look at what two books I'm buying. And it was a book about screenplay writing and an encyclopedia of marijuana. (laughs) (laughs) What a role model. Yeah, like, you're on the right track, man. Do you get special (laughs) treatment at the comic book store? I mean, do people uh, at the the store try to assist you and help you? Sometimes, Uh, maybe. They'll tell me they could, if if there's anything I need to order, they'll put it on back order for me. (laughs) Because because it's, it's quite charming that you still do this. I mean, you could go on the internet and buy comic books. You don't need to necessarily. Yeah. Be at the but store, you're but looking for new stuff right. now. You want it's some advice? Internet. I like. Uh, I don't know. I like having you like the, the actual comic, comic book. book. And what is Toy Tokyo? What is that all about? And what are you doing there? Uh, it's like uh, they sell like vinyl Japanese toys. I kind <laughs> of. Uh, <laughs> you collect that stuff? I do. A while ago, I got into. Uh, uh, a lot of like I don't know. It's, it's going to make figures? me sound like a fucking huge nerd. <laughs> but, <laughs> it's, right. I, uh, it's okay. Yeah. Uh, no, not action figures. I collect like a lot of artists. I like make these like vinyl Japanese or not not some some of them are made in China and Japan. But a lot of artists I like make these vinyl toys, and I've been collecting those for years. Where do you display the vinyl toys? Uh, my office has a lot of them. They're kind of around the house. It's and, kind of a battle to w- where I could get them. <laughs> <laughs> and you like it. Oh, yeah, and the, it's like pop art to me. That's yeah. why it's like they're they're it's it's like pop art. <laughs> but you seem like a, a guy who's really sort of at the same point. You have a lot of friends and this and that. But then there's a, your solitary Seth Rogen. He writes. Yeah. He smokes and he has his toys. Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> my comics and my toys. 